The Queen of Spades by Alexander Pushkin is a compelling short story that explores themes of obsession, fate, and the destructive pursuit of wealth. Written in the early 19th century, the narrative is set against the backdrop of the decadent society of Imperial Russia, and Pushkin skillfully weaves together elements of the supernatural with psychological depth to create a tale that resonates with timeless human struggles. At the core of the story is the character of Hermann, a young and ambitious officer who becomes enamored with the idea of acquiring a secret gambling strategy from an elderly countess, known as the Queen of Spades. Hermann's obsession with obtaining this mysterious knowledge becomes the driving force of the narrative, leading him down a path of moral decay and self-destruction. The theme of obsession is evident throughout the story, as Hermann becomes fixated on the Countess and her alleged knowledge of the winning card combinations. His single-minded pursuit of this information blinds him to the consequences of his actions and the toll it takes on his own sanity. Pushkin skillfully captures the destructive nature of obsession, highlighting how it can lead individuals to abandon reason and ethical considerations in the relentless pursuit of their desires. The supernatural elements introduced in the narrative add an intriguing layer to the story. The appearance of the ghostly Queen of Spades and the Countess's uncanny ability to predict winning card combinations contribute to an atmosphere of mystery and suspense. Pushkin leaves the nature of these supernatural occurrences open to interpretation, allowing readers to question whether they are products of Hermann's deteriorating mental state or genuine supernatural interventions. This ambiguity enhances the psychological complexity of the narrative, inviting readers to engage with the story on multiple levels. Fate is another prominent theme in The Queen of Spades. Hermann's destiny seems intertwined with the mysterious secret he seeks, and his relentless pursuit ultimately leads to a tragic and inevitable conclusion. Pushkin explores the idea that individuals may be powerless in the face of their predetermined destinies, a theme that reflects the fatalistic outlook prevalent in Russian literature of the time. The story raises questions about the extent to which individuals can control their own lives and destinies, and whether the pursuit of wealth and power can ultimately lead to happiness. The narrative structure of The Queen of Spades is concise and tightly woven, with each element contributing to the overall impact of the story. Pushkin's use of vivid and evocative language enhances the atmosphere of the narrative, immersing readers in the opulent and decadent world of Imperial Russia. The author's keen understanding of human psychology is evident in his portrayal of Hermann's descent into madness, capturing the nuances of obsession and its devastating consequences. The characters in the story are well drawn, with Hermann standing out as a complex and tragic figure. Pushkin skillfully portrays his transformation from a seemingly rational and ambitious officer to a man consumed by greed and paranoia. The secondary characters, such as the enigmatic Countess and Hermann's love interest, Lisa, add depth to the narrative and contribute to the exploration of themes such as love, betrayal, and the corrupting influence of wealth. In conclusion, The Queen of Spades is a masterfully crafted short story that combines elements of the supernatural with a psychological exploration of human behavior. Pushkin's exploration of themes such as obsession, fate, and the pursuit of wealth elevates the narrative beyond a simple ghost story, making it a timeless and thought-provoking work of literature. Through the tragic tale of Hermann, Pushkin invites readers to reflect on the consequences of unchecked ambition and the fragility of the human psyche in the face of obsession and destiny.